<laughs> Hi there, Sagittarius. Guess who? Yeah, it's me. It's my lady. I am so happy to be back. I am happy that you're here with me. Um, I've been out and about and uh, just taking care of my health. So I'm missing in action and I'm back now. So happy to have you here. I want to thank my subscribers for their loyalty. And I want to bring you this uh, uh, mid-April mini reading sneak peek for my Sagittarius. <laughs> so, how did you like that intro? <laughs> Those uh, sound effects go along with the cards. I love these cards and I want to share them with you. So, let's go ahead and jump into this reading for you, Sag. So, uh, you have uh, some very interesting cards here. Don't be scared on what you're seeing here. There's a message here and I want to share it with you, okay? So this is what we got. So for the first card, Masker of uh, Cups, uh, this talks about emotional stability and balance, okay? So this card is the master of emotions for you, all right? So it's uh, asking you to, uh, or telling you, you know, allowing space for the entire spectrum without letting the feelings take over when you're feeling, um, you know, without letting feelings take over. So when you're feeling attacked, Sagittarius, don't react over um, out of anger. Find the time to articulate your feelings before responding. Okay, so it's talking about your feelings, uh, you know, your emotions or, you know, uh, it's, a, you know, everybody goes through everything, Sagittarius. We all go through something here uh, in life. Okay, you're not the only one. So, you know, it's the way we handle it or the way we uh, what we do to take care of it and resolve our issues. Okay. Um, your next card is the, uh, the death card. And, um, you know, in this, uh, the deck, uh, well, this deck of cards is basically letting, letting you know that with the death card, uh, usually it just means releasing, you know, endings. So, uh, it's to let, it's for you to let go of something that's not serve, no longer serving you. So, um, your pain and suffering is valid and you need to give it space. But remember, Sag, that this loss is important for growth. Okay. So what does the five of crystal mean here for you? Okay. It's like the lack of uh, resources. Okay. So I get it. I get it, Sag, you know, been there, done that, you know, when, you know, the house um, needs to be, um, uh, needs, um, of repair, the children are growing out of their clothes, and you're not sure where the next, uh, or right, the money, you know, where the money is going to come from for the next meal, uh, you know, where you're going to go next, or where where's all this going to come from, right, for you to uh, take care of your, the issues that, you know, most of us go through, or once in our life, twice of our life, I mean, I, I'm just going on and talking here but you know what i mean okay take a deep breath sag all right and don't be afraid to reach out for help this is not about pride it's about survival okay and let me tell you why i'm saying this um with the masker of bones here it's letting it, it's telling you you know you're a leader sagittarius you are a leader okay it's telling you to take leadership okay it's time to uh uh to give or with with intent and purpose okay to do more and that you have a goal so use your skills and accomplishments okay you're not one to sit around and wait for things to come to you you are one to go and get them because you are a leader and that's what you are sagittarius so don't you know take the help that you can now and then get yourself back on your feet. And that's what I have for you, Sag. Bye-bye now.